So we are getting ready to go to St. Augustine. Uh, I've never been, it's crazy. Uh, I've been living in Florida for what, 30 years? Never been to St. Augustine, it's the oldest city. So we're just packing the truck. We're pretty much ready to go. What's up, everybody? The Alexanders are in St. Augustine. First time that we're here. Yeah. And, and we're super excited. Um, I know we always say that we're super excited, but we are. We love traveling. We love history. This is the oldest city in the U.S. And, uh, you know, we're excited to take you along with us and show you what St. Augustine has to offer. The Floridian. It's supposed to be a, a really good place. Uh, a lot of reviews. Over 1,800 reviews on Google. So we're excited to check out the food. It's southern style with a little contemporary flair to it jade's being cute now no more crying right can you say hi jade hi hi, hi. Yeah. jade what does the alligator do <laughs> visit you here. Snakes, lizards, spiders, mosquitoes, roaches, bats, rats, squirrels, possums, raccoons, maybe even a baby. I don't know. This is Florida. We got weird things in our woods. Now this here is our gallows and we are a hanging jail. We've had eight documented hangings. There's even some documented part. There may have been a few that happened, but the sheriff just didn't want anybody to know about it. He's just that kind of guy. It's a good world. St. Augustine was the oldest city in the United States. It still is, Mr. Hamlin. And it looked it. Say hi, Jay. Hi. Who's on the phone? All right, can you say bye bye? Bye bye. All right. We're here at the oldest store. We just took an awesome tour with Genevieve. And Jade is watching an old commercial from 1908. What do you see, Jade? Gummy. Creepy Annabelle dolls here.
going down the hallway, beautiful hotel, the Hilton, St. Augustine Beach. I'm pushing this, this big thing here. I'm trying to navigate this thing. It's harder than I expected. Funny. Yeah, funny. Are you ready to see the room? Let's see what we got. Ooh, this is nice. Wow, Gigi says wow. Good job, Mama. I know, the fist is our baby moon that we have to, we have to go out in style. Complimentary little bag, honors. honors bag with our waters. A little dust there to do some work. Not, no, no work. Nice bathroom. And you have the room, the suite, TV. Oh, we got a nice view too. Hilton uh, Embassy Suites in St. Augustine on the water. It's absolutely gorgeous here. Um, we're on the beach. Our room has a partial ocean view. And um, we were so pleasantly surprised by all the amenities. There's a Starbucks on site, just um, impeccable rooms, extremely clean and safe. We're about to go out to dinner, but before, before our dinner reservation, we wanted to check out the sunset. Yeah, beautiful sunset. It couldn't have been nicer either. And there's fire. They have fire pits all around. It's extremely contemporary and modern, which is what we love. There were other hotels here, bed and breakfasts, uh, historic, um, historic style, Spanish style. But Jonathan and I were a sucker for the contemporary modern look. Yeah. Um, so we couldn't pass this opportunity up. The lights just went on, literally, oh, as we're on this camera. Up. Let's show oh, you. Look. They just lit up the pool. Look at this. Oh. We are here at Sunset Grill. It's got over 3,000 reviews. We wanted a, a, you know, a delicious seafood place um, that was close to our hotel here on the beach. And we are trying out this award-winning New England clam chowder. Supposedly it's amazing, and I love clam chowder. So this is like a perfect marriage, uh, besides the one that I have for Lily, of course. Good answer. Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and try this clam chowder. So I can tell you. And I've had him all over. Of course, you gotta put the, the captain's wafers on there. Soak them in a little bit. Let's give it a shot. Oh, God. It's so warm and delicious. And homey and just... And the weather's perfect. It's 72 degrees. I mean, come on. Yeah. You can't ask for more. Wow. It's so good. It's so creamy. As good as advertised, for sure. I might need another bowl. This is too good. <laughs> I think she did a poo poo. Jay, did you do a poo poo? Uh oh. <laughs> so you turn a little red there. Uh oh. Did Jay do a poo poo? No. No, you just saw poo poo. Can you show us the animals? What animals are those? I go. What is that? Show the camera. Show the camera. Let's see that. What is that? Let's see. TV.
first time at the beach, it's cool that we have this documented. Um, it's funny because she at first was hesitant and then she said, okay, let me try it out and uh, started walking on the sand and tippy toeing and thought it was hot, but it's really not. And now she's getting a little bit more comfortable and um, collecting sea so That's her thing right now.
delicious, right? Yeah. Look at this handwriting. It's so sophisticated and fancy. We don't even do cursive anymore. Look <laughs> no. at these kids. This was like a hundred years ago or more. So we are walking along St. George Street right now. Took our masks off. Took our masks off to, to breathe, breathe, a breathe a little bit. A little bit. It's pretty cool how historic it is and how uh, narrow the street is and having a good time here with Jade. The architectural integrity they um, attempted to keep in place. I think most of the structures are as original. The wooden schoolhouse that we just visited. All of the cedar, all of the wood, everything was in original form. So that was that was really interesting. You saw plushes? Which plushes? The one from Norway and the one from oh, the Middle East. No. I can't even say their names. <laughs> How cool are these? Very medieval. <laughs> Baby. They're purple. It's very grand in here. Chandeliers, pillars, columns, glass. They lived really good back then. Take a look at these salt shakers. Honey, can you please pass me the speckled glass swirl salt, please? It's probably just as expensive as our house. Or, you know what? Uh, actually, I'm in the mood for the spangled glass bulb <laughs> or the They're Mount Washington cool. peach blow. They're elaborate.
All right, so we're here waiting uh, to eat lunch. It's a late lunch, actually. It is a late lunch. At, at the famous Colombia restaurant. It's Cuban cuisine. We were stuffed from earlier, so we waited until later this afternoon. Um, it was a 45 minute wait because this place is extremely popular. Um, it's slowing down a little bit, so hopefully they call our names soon. Um, in the meantime, Jonathan entertained Jade and I was able to go to a local honey store across the way. I grabbed some bourbon honey and uh, some sourdough bread mix. So uh, we'll be trying that when we get back home to South Florida. And Jade, in the meantime, Jade is on the iPad. Yeah, we're being bad parents right now and, and letting her entertain herself. Right. Let's put together some of the pieces that are missing, like her Finishing up our trip now with a nice little brunch over at the historic ice plant. It's rainy. St. Augustine Distillery. We're gonna see if we can get a tour in today. This yeah. place is awesome. It's like in a warehouse. What does it say? It says drinks. Spritz. Orange juice. Apple juice. Cranberry juice. We are finishing up our St. Augustine trip and uh, this place is really cool. It's like Prohibition style, um, very trendy, food is delicious. It's, it's been really fun. Um, unfortunately, we were supposed to do the the, the, uh, the Fountain of Youth, but with the weather, we can't do it today. So we're, we're gonna finish up here, we might go get some chocolate, and then we're heading back four hours to South Florida. Mama's turn. Mama turn? She let me have some. Mm. All right, everybody. Today's Sunday, it's rainy. The Alexanders had a great time at, in St. Augustine. We are headed back. We were planning on um, staying here, you know, till today, but uh, doing a couple more things like the uh, the, the Wetson uh, chocolate, what is it called? Factory. Chocolate yeah, factory. Tour. And the distillery tour over at Ice Plant. Unfortunately, it's raining. People were waiting outside and with Jade, it would be too much for us to wait outside in the rain. So we decided we're gonna head back now and uh, conclude our trip, but it was a lot of fun. Hope you guys like the footage and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Alexander's out. Alexander's out.